Hi, Nicole Walker here with you. I wanted to share a little tip with you this evening about our reflection necklace. This actually comes to me as a request of a couple of my customers as well as a few advisors on my team who would like a little refresher on some of the versatility with this beautiful necklace. So, let's move in a little bit and let me show you a few things about this necklace. First of all, I'm showing the reflection, which is this beautiful long piece with the silver discs. Um, nice sparkle, lightweight, perfect beginner for people wanting to layer the long with the shorter necklace. The shorter necklace pictured here is for keeps, and it can be found in our spring and summer catalog on page 46, one of my favorite Leah Sophia pieces. So let's go on and show you a little bit about this Reflections necklace. First of all, as you can see, um, nice long piece, lightweight, very lightweight, nice sparkle without adding um, any weight to the piece, no crystals, stones, you know, semi-precious stones, nothing like that weighing you down. That's why it's the perfect beginner piece for people who maybe might not be used to wearing a longer necklace layered with a short. But there's also some fun things you can do with this necklace that we're going to show you. And the first one is to just go ahead and double it up and wear it as a short necklace. Nice little look, lots of sparkle with no crystals. That's just all the, that beautiful rhodium coating, which is a platinum family metal, which Leah Sophia is very well known for. Gives it that nice, brilliant white look. Okay, another thing we can do is go ahead and just pull one down a little bit longer and wear one a little bit shorter. Very nice look. If you want to get even a little bit more daring, and you have a nice long lean neck, you can go ahead and, and pull it up nice and tight up here and actually wear it chokered and back. And another thing that I like to do with this necklace to kind of pull it up shorter for you is what we call a lariat. And a lariat's really simple. It's kind of like folding a scarf. We're going to take this necklace and put it out long ways. We're going to put the clasp in the middle. Let me go ahead and move my camera up so you can see it a little bit better. And we're going to put that behind the back so that the clasp is right in the back. We're going to bring it around front. See how I have these two loops here? I'm just going to pull one through. And then we've got that great lariated look. There we go. And that's a great little look for that piece. If you don't have a longer, thinner neck, and maybe you just don't want something up that tight against your, close to, to your uh, neckline, you can also do it a little bit longer with a technique that we call just plain old tying. And what you do is you take it like you're going to tie a shoe, and you determine how much you want to hang down. And I'm going to leave about that much hang down, okay? And all I'm going to do is, like I'm tying a shoe, I'm going to take my two ends, and I'm going to pull one through the other, and just put a nice little light tie in there. Don't worry, not going to hurt the necklace at all. This is really a sturdy piece. It looks delicate, but boy, I tell you, I've had this one in my kit for five years. And it's been through the ringer. And now you're getting the longer lariat look. There. That's the whole look. And again, you can wear that lariat with another piece of jewelry if you like. Again, to add another um, kind of piece just to bring the eyes up a little bit. That's the nice thing about uh, a great necklace. It draws attention from the thighs up to the eyes for you. And that's our reflection necklace. And that one can be found on page 12 of the Leah Sophia Spring and Summer Catalog. You can view the whole catalog at my website, www for 
theloveofjewelry.com and that's the number four theloveofjewelry.com be sure to check us out